So this is a new roast. We're at a little over 300 degrees. We're doing some Columbia. I've got the machine, the precipitator turned off just so you can see the smoke. Hopefully you're able to get a better picture. We're still getting a lot of air out here blowing the smoke quickly away from the uh, exhaust pipe, which is making it harder to detect. But watch that for a minute and I'll tell you a little bit about what we're seeing. Okay, so we're up to about 440 some degrees. And the precipitator is off. I'm going to kick it on for a minute and see if you notice a reduction. It'll take about a minute. Okay, you should be able to see that it reduced it dramatically. I'm going to kick it back off just so you can see because as it gets up to first crack you're going to see a lot more smoke and this is five pounds of Columbia so we're up to 363 degrees it's still a really light bean hasn't gone into first crack yet but you can see that uh, even though it hasn't gone into first crack, there's some smoke coming out. And that's because the precipitator's off. Okay, it's starting to pick up a little bit more. When we get into first crack, you'll see it pick up quite a bit. It's almost 380 degrees, so we should see first crack. Okay, you can start to see a little bit more smoke. Uh, it's just now getting ready to start first crack. Yeah, we can see a little bit more smoke. Let's see if we can get it a little bit more. Yeah, just now going into first crack, 387 degrees. Okay, you can probably see a decent amount of smoke. It's just now starting to go into a rolling, light rolling first crack, not a real heavy. So I'm going to kick on the precipitator. And in about a minute you should see it reduce it. Okay, you can see pretty much it's reduced it down to where you can't really vis visually see much smoke, a little bit. I'm going to kick it back off because we're going into a rolling first crack and uh, you should see in a minute quite a bit of smoke. 407 degrees. Still a really light bean. Okay, you can see quite a bit of smoke here. Now let me kick on the precipitator. So watch in about 30 seconds to see what it does to reduce it. Okay, you can see now it's reduced it quite a bit. There's still a little bit of smoke. Well now you can't hardly, I can't visually see any. Well just a teeny little bit. And some of that may be steam as well. I'm going to kick it back off tell you the temperature. We're now at about 424 degrees. I'm going to take this up to about 440. And so you can see a, a quite a bit of smoke right at the moment here coming out. That's at about 425 to 433 degrees. Okay, you can see a lot of smoke. Let me kick on the precipitator and see what we see in the way of reduction. It may be going in, getting ready to go into a second crack. So you can see it cutting it back quite a bit, but it's still got a little bit of smoke. Yeah, it's going into a second crack. Okay, so we just... Uh, you might have seen a puff of smoke. We just uh, brought it into the cooling tray at about 440.